In this video, we're going to use the cofunction identities. It says write the following function in terms of its cofunction. So it says cotangent pi over 12. Well, I know that cotangent is a cofunction with tangent. So what they want us to do is they want us to switch this or, we, or find an equivalent expression. So we're going to say that cotangent of pi over 12 is actually equal to some version of tangent uh, and it has to end at some version of tangent with pi over 12 being used. Well, if I'm in the same quadrant, if I, if I have cotangent tangent and I'm talking about the same quadrant, there are always two spots in the quadrant where cotangent and tangent are equal to each other. And those two spots are where the angles add up to 90 degrees. So if I have cotangent of pi over 12, then if I find an angle for tangent that when added to pi over 12 gives me pi over 2, then these two things would be equivalent. So the formula for this tangent piece would be tangent of, tangent of 90 minus theta typically. But we're going to use, because we're in radians here, we're going to use tangent of pi over 2, which is 90 degrees, minus theta. Well, they tell us theta right here. We know that theta is actually pi over 12 right now. So we're going to write this as cotangent theta, or cotangent pi over 12, is equal to tangent of pi over 2 minus pi over 12. Well, if I go through and I multiply the top and the bottom by 6, that's going to give me tangent of 6 pi over, oh, 6 pi over 12 minus pi over 12, which will be tangent of 5 pi over 12. So tangent of 5 pi over 12 is actually equal to cotangent of pi over 12. So that's our cofunction there. 